Today I'm just doing a quick video about how to replace the air filter on a 2013 Audi Allroad. It's the same job for an A4 with this same engine or a Q5 or an A5. They all pretty much have the same air, figure configure, air filter configuration. So start by removing this clamp off this air boot. Once that clamp is removed, you can just pull this air boot right back. Now you have access to all of the six screws that hold the top cover onto the air filter housing, these Torx bits. So you get your Torx driver and you remove these six screws and you just pull the top cover right off. So I'm going to do that now. All right, with those screws all removed, you can just take this, lift it up. I left the harness connector still on the air mass meter, so I just take it and lift it up out of the way. There's enough slack there where you're fine. You won't hurt anything. And better off that than da risking damaging the plug, even though you can probably get it off without breaking it. It's just, it's just fine to do it like this. So pull the air filter element up, out, and get a shop vac and vacuum all this debris out of the housing. So I'm gonna do that now. Now that all the debris is out, take your new filter, stick it in, take your top cover, put that back into place. And most important thing is you wanna tighten all these screws by hand because half of the cars that come in here, these screws are either stripped and they don't they no longer bite because somebody used a power tool to install them or the housing itself is cracked around the screws from being over torqued so what you want to do now is just tighten all these up evenly with a little quarter inch drive ratchet and uh, put your boot back on and you're good to go thanks <laughs> 